Uh, hey tubes. I'm going to show you how to decompress and re extract this valve on a beer keg. Now first things first you'll need two screwdrivers, one thicker one, and one thinner one. And I'll show you what the thinner one is for in a minute. First thing you want to do is make sure that all the pressure in the tank is relieved or else you're going to have a real real messy time and possibly dangerous. You could lose uh, an eye or you know, break a leg. To decompress this, we need to take your screwdriver and jam it into that ball. But stay away from it. Put some safety glasses on, a face shield or something, because that pressure is going to shoot that beer right out. Okay? This is what you have under there. You have this at the bottom of the tank, and this is your valve. So you're taking the screwdriver, wedging it in here, and squeezing it. Either down or aside. You want to wedge it under that rubber lip right there and kind of just crank it down okay so I'm gonna do that I already decompressed this one so I'm just gonna do this for showing you demonstration purposes so once it's decompressed you fully decompress it push it down you can see that ball valve moving I'll show you in a closer pick So all I did was this. Okay, next thing is you want to take your smaller screwdriver. Now I'm going to show you how to extract the valve and the stem. Now what you have here, you have this retaining ring and it's just a ring that's folded over kind of like your key ring, right? And it's in there holding this under this lip, all right? So what you do is you're gonna have an access point here and an access point there. And you're gonna wanna find the part of that ring that is closest to the top. So you go to this access point, one of the access points, and you wedge your screwdriver in, your small one, and you just kinda work your way, work that retaining ring out. Could get difficult. Now you see what I did there? I popped it out a bit. I'll give you a zoom in on that. Now once you pop that ring, sometimes you have to wedge it in there. There's going to be a little cut out there so you could get a screwdriver in there. Now you take that screwdriver and you run it along and you kind of pry it out. See what I'm doing? And you want to go easy. And make sure you decompress this. I can't stress this enough. Make sure it's decompressed or else this valve will just could possibly pop up and hit you in the face if you're not being careful. Okay, that is out. We'll put it to the side. And now we just have to align this with the slots. So you take your screwdriver, take your bigger one, and you turn it until you see a little cutout and you pull these slots out, line it up and you pull it out. 
So it goes in the same way and comes out. Locked, unlocked. And there you go. You pulled out your valve stem. There's the valve. Here's a stem that sucks up the beer from the bottom of the keg. And now you can open up your keg and do whatever you want. Clean it out, brew some beer, make a still, gas tank for a hot rod, whatever. Anyways, thanks for watching. Take care.